Wah, check this out guys. Uh, top up to get a designated A car or outfit and then look at the treasure box. You can get Wings of Time and Magic Wardrobe. I'm not sure which one is this. Let's claim both of them. This reminds me of the White Stallion and the uh, Dawnbreaker. Okay, of course, I'm, I want to take white, uh, Wings of Time. <laughs> I actually got a chance to get Wings of Time permanent. Nice. But I don't know what is Night Phantom. Which one is that? Okay, take Wings of Time. Wow. <laughs> Who would have thought I can get Wings of Time permanent? There's no animation for this one, right? <laughs> so might as well take the other one. Not the Night Phantom. The Celestial Love one. It's a magic wardrobe. Uh, Celestial Love, this one, eh? Night Phantom is just a normal costume. Yeah, it's this, it's this whole thing. Okay, but I already own some of it. <laughs> I own the hair already. I own, own the... Let me see the costume. Oh, it's this one. The first ever Magic Wardrobe. Hmm, maybe I prefer the female one for this. <laughs> I think the female one's better. Yeah, I'm taking the female one. There you go. <laughs> well, uh, for those who spend uh, the, ga the, the for those who actually finish the gacha for this magic wardrobe, well, sorry for you guys. <laughs> I just got it by top up diamonds. Anyway. Okay guys, I'm back in Garena Speed Drifters. So, you saw that box that I opened just now. There was uh, Vulcan, there was Poseidon and Wings of Time, right? I already reviewed Wings of Time. So I'm thinking maybe I should review those uh, cars, eh? Vulcan, Poseidon and maybe Ice King. So, Fire, Water and Ice. So we'll start with Vulcan, eh? Where is Vulcan? There it is. Oh, I haven't filmed out yet. Okay, anyway. Look at the characteristic first. With within the first 30 seconds of race, max speed plus 3.5 km per hour and gain one additional nitro when use nitro for the first time in game. Okay. So Vulcan early game car definitely. This was one of the first early game car release. After I think it was Spirit Breaker. After Spirit Breaker release, they released uh, Vulcan. This is the first ever car that introduced early game. Like having a nitro after using your first nitro. <laughs> Let me full mod first. Okay, this is without infinity chip first. Eh? The modding is right, left, left, middle. Okay, pretty sure that's the right modding. And this car before infinity chip, it was tier 3. Eh? So let's see how strong is it uh, without infinity chip first. Okay, normal speed will be 206.9 Double boost? 249 Hey, why double? Why the normal speed very fast eh? <laughs> okay Oh, it's 30 seconds Yeah, yeah, I forgot, I forgot 30 seconds, you have a uh, fast speed, okay See the double? 311.8 This is still 30 seconds eh? WCW? 294.9 uh, the 30 seconds over, okay. Okay, without first, eh? CW 308.3 WCW 291.4 Okay, now normal speed 203.4 Double boost 245.5 Okay uh, I, I was surprised there. It, it, it's fast because of uh, 30 seconds. Eh? First 30 seconds, your speed is uh, increased. <laughs> okay. So after double boost with ability 249 eh? Okay, WCW with 30 seconds 316 
Yes, 316. WCW 316, CW 301.8, WCW 294.9. That's for the first 30 seconds, eh? So after the 30 second is over, WCW is 312.5. Oops. Yes, 312.5. And CW 308.3, WCW 291.4. Okay. So it's fast on the first 30 seconds. But then you'll go back to normal after the 30 seconds is over. And you realize that uh, after you use your first nitro, you get another nitro. So basically, early game car. Lah. Okay, early game car suitable for short maps. Now we put in the infinity chip and let's see how strong is it. Eh? What is buff? Nitro power plus 10, mini boost power plus 6, basic power plus 3, max mini boost got increased, nitro max speed also got increased, charge time also. Alright. Check the modding for one. Right, left, middle, uh, left, middle. Okay, right, left, middle is correct, yeah. Okay, with infinity chip, let's see the speed. Uh, first 30 seconds. First, normal speed. 206.9, still the same, I think. Double boost, 249.7. Okay, that's a bit higher. CWW, 312.7. Got slightly higher there. WCW 295.6 and WCWW 317. Okay, all right now without eh? wait, double speed is 203.4, double boost 246.2. I think that's still the same. CWW 309.2 Wow, okay, still strong eh? WCW 292.1 Okay, there's slightly increase in CW, WCW Yeah, 309.3 actually 2 or 3, I'm not sure Okay, so that is for Vulcan eh? From tier 3, maybe increase to tier 1 I, I guess 2 to two or 1 Alright This ranking is actually 31 31st In the In my tier Ranking list video Falcon is ranking 31st Okay I want to test all straight away eh? We test every Car speed uh, And then later We test it on maps Straight away Let's test uh, Poseidon next Okay for Poseidon Nitro strength I think that's nitro power Plus 12% Automatically fills end tank to fill 4% and increase the maximum speed of nitro 3 km per hour when not in first position. Okay. When you're not first place, your end tank will automatically increase and your max speed plus 3 km per hour. And it will uh, end 2 seconds when you're first. Okay. What's the. This one not modded yet. Eh? Okay, let me mod first. Okay, I modded everything. Uh, modding is all left. Eh? Left. Left, left, and left. Okay, for this Poseidon car, this is a tier 1 car actually. Before Infinity Chip, it's already tier 1. So, yeah, just now Vulcan, I say it was tier 3. It's up to tier 1 now, see. And Poseidon is tier 1, maybe up to tier 1. No change because uh, Infinity Chip only so little. So, yeah, I think tier 1 then to tier 1, alright? Okay, but let's check uh, without Infinity Chip first. Alright, so normal speed is 202.2, double boost 245.7, CWW 309.4. Okay, without Infinity Chip, we need 390. WCW 292. Okay. WCWW 313.7 Alright So 
So Poseidon is already strong without Infinity Chip. That's why with Infinity Chip also not much change. Eh? Let's see uh, how little is it uh, increase with Infinity Chip. What was it again? Max mini boost plus 0.2. Okay. Uh, so it's only plus 0.2 after Infinity Chip and Nitro Power. That's all. Sadly, Poseidon didn't get any much buff, eh? but it's already tier 1, that's why. Oh yeah, uh, just confirming. Left, 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 yes, correct. Okay, let's see, eh? probably not much difference. Normal speed. Is it the same? Yes, the same, 202.2. .2. Double boost. 245.9 slightly up there CWW 309.5 yeah only plus 0 0.2 WCW 292 is everything plus 0 0.2 <laughs> WCWW 313.5 okay wait I'm doing it wrongly. 213.9, not, not 5. 213.9. Yeah, 213.9. Alright. For Poseidon, I'll say it's uh, more to a versus uh, competitive uh, when you're versusing someone. Because if you don't, if you're only playing alone, the ability will not activate for Poseidon. Okay, so that is the two uh, fire and water. Third one I want to review is the Ice King. Okay, so for Ice King, it's a characteristic is increased mini boost max speed by 0.8 km and power by 1.6 km every 8 seconds and can be stacked up to 20 times so every 8 seconds this car goes faster and faster and faster until 20 times it will go very fast eh? I last time I recommended this on rally because rally is a very long map <laughs> yeah this car is suitable for long maps and I already full modded the modding is all left 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 infinity chips they haven't put in Normal speed 201.1. Okay, we should wait eh, until it's uh because it's activating every 8 seconds. So I'll wait it until 20. Okay, just showing right now. Um let me just keep going. Just now it was 201.1, it's still 201.1, eh? so it doesn't affect base speed, it affects mini boost speed. So if I double boost now. 254.6 activate one more time 255.4 yeah so it, it increases 0 0.8 km every time the passive increase, increases number up there so it's still increasing let me wait first okay it's 20 right about now okay so what's the double boost now 261.8 so if we don't count the 20, that is uh, minus 16. 245.8. 245.8 is normal double boost. With the 20 stack, is 261.8. Alright. So CW. 322.1. Without uh, the stack, it will be 306.1. WCW. 297.8 so without it will be 281.8 let me check again yeah 291.8 so without is 275.8 <laughs> I have to minus 16 every uh, and for every speed okay now WCW 328.2 so without it will be 312.2 I think so 
Uh, this is without infinity chip. Let's see how fast is it with. Because it's a tier 2 car, it should be up to tier 1 because this car is ranking better than Falcon and Poseidon. It's ranking 26 in that video. So definitely tier 1 also. Top speed plus 0.2. Oh, see my Poseidon. Oh, but there's a mini boost power, nitro power, basic power. Okay. So, uh, increases max speed only 0.2, same like Poseidon, but a lot more power, more acceleration. And let me check again the modding as usual. Left, 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 left. Okay, it's correct. Okay, it's 20. I realize uh, every time I do CW and uh, uh, passive increases, it doesn't always increase by 0 0.8, you know. Sometimes it's only increased by 0 0.6 or 7. So the speed might not be exactly correct eh, when you do CW without any passive. Anyway, let's look at the speed eh. uh, without anything. Normal speed is at 201.2. Okay. Double boost is 262. So normal will be 246. CW 322.3. Hoo -hoo. So without it will be 306.3 .3, which I don't think it is eh? maybe it's 308 or 309 eh? I think it should be 309 without the passive supposed to be 309 but after the passive it become 322.3 .3. so it's not exactly 0 0.8 per stack eh? alright WCW 298 okay I will say WCW without stack will be 282 which I don't think it is eh? And WCW 328.4. Alright. So that's the speed after 20 stacks. Okay. You know what? Let me just confirm it. What is the speed without the stack? Okay. So, so I'll quickly do the speed. Just uh, CW double. Okay. Okay. Damn it. We start. Three zero nine point five. Oh, okay. I thought it's only three zero nine. All right. WCW. Three zero nine point six. Okay, guys, that's your speed. Uh, speed without any stack. Eh? <laughs> okay, that's it. This is quite long already. We already done testing with and without Infinity Chip. Let's straight away test it on some maps. So all three of them are here, right? Ice King is Babylon. Okay. What about Falcon? Babylon or so? <laughs> Poseidon? Okay, all three we play Babylon then. Okay, we'll play all three Babylon, eh? We'll play Babylon three times. Using Vulcan, Poseidon and then Ice King. I got Nitro straight away. I forgot really how to play this map.
153 <laughs> Okay Alright, now Poseidon But I think it's better when there are people around But never mind <laughs> I don't remember now. One, okay, slightly better or two. Okay, and this will be the last one. I messed up. One fifty. <laughs> Slightly increase every time. I think because I've gotten uh, familiar a bit more. Okay, I'm gonna test some maps that are, I think, suitable to use this car. City 11 is a long map, so I think I'll use Ice King for this. Damn 
Okay, Leute, wann ist sie? Wow, strong, man. Eh? Almost one minute. Or at least one, let's say one minute. Yeah, second lap, almost one minute. <laughs> okay, for Poseidon, I just play one quick game. Just any map will do, as long as they are opponents. <laughs> Okay, the ability is activated because I'm not first. Oh. So I'm slowly gaining and tank. <laughs> okay, I'm first. After two seconds, the ability is gone. Alright I need to end this quick so I'll just play Vulcan uh, solo on a short map that I think is suitable Ok but I need to get a knife throw first eh? There you go
Wow. Not bad. <coughs> okay, hey guys. So yeah, I think that will be it for Vulcan, Poseidon, and Ice King review, triple review. So my recommendation eh, for if you're getting Vulcan, it's good for early. Uh, how do I say this? It's good for short maps because it's an early game car. You get a nitro after you use your first nitro, so it's an early game car. Suitable for maps like Autumn Story, um, Highway One. Okay. For Poseidon, it's good for okay competitive versus when you are not in first place. That's when uh, this car's passive will activate. For Ice King, it is suitable for long maps. So the longest map I know is actually uh, Miss Valley, eh, which is now a reminiscent map. So right now in that that's not reminiscence, it's I guess now C or maybe City Eleven. City Eleven is longer, I think. But yeah, maybe also if you want, you can use it in even in rally mode. But uh, full rally, uh, not not uh, the three player rally. That one won't help much. Okay, so yeah, I think that will be it for this elemental fire, water, and ice car review. Eh? Triple review, three in one. <laughs> for the ice king, it's not in that box that I opened, but uh, Vulcan and Poseidon is. So yeah, if you guys are planning to do some top up. You can get one of these permanent A car, uh, Vulcan or Poseidon. You can choose that, or you can get Wings of Time. I already reviewed Wings of Time also. But Ice King, uh, yeah, I just wanted to put Ice King in because it's a uh, element like fire, water, ice. <laughs> that's why I included in this video. All right, so yeah, that's all for this video, guys. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.